Hydraulic fracturing, or fracking, is the process by which water, sand, and other chemicals are injected into the ground in order to recover fossil fuels stored inside rock formations. The process of fracking begins with the injection of water and other substances into a well at high pressures. The increase in pressure causes a nearby rock to fracture, releasing fossil fuels that were originally trapped in the rock. The desired product then travels back up the well for recovery. The concepts of fracking can be traced back to as early as the 1860s. But it wasn't until 1949, when St. Olin Oil produced the first frac well, that the process of hydraulic fracturing was truly developed. Later, it was discovered that fracking could be used not only to increase oil production, but also to recover unconventional natural gases. Although hydraulic fracturing has been around for many years, only recently has fracking experienced a boom in growth. Gas production from fracking shale rock in the United States has risen five-fold between the years of 2006 and 2010. There are two reasons behind this increase in production, advancements in technology and historical policy. Shale gas is considered an unconventional natural gas, one which is too difficult or too costly to extract. However, recent advancements in technology such as horizontal drilling have allowed shale production to increase dramatically. Sedimentary rocks such as shale are deposited in horizontal layers. Thus, as opposed to drilling numerous vertical wells, horizontal drilling allows a more efficient way to access the shale rock. The shale gas production boom is also a product of historical policy. Up until the early 1970s, natural gas reserves were dwindling, contributing to energy shortages in consumer states. As a result, in 1978, Congress passed the Natural Gas Policy Act, which provided incentives for the extraction of unconventional natural gases. This stimulated the growth of hydraulic fracturing and also led to the discovery of more natural gas reserves. The recent boom in shale production has provided America with an important energy resource. However, such a fast-growing industry is difficult to regulate, which brings about many concerns regarding the industry's effect on the environment. The contamination of groundwater is a primary concern, as most shale deposits are located next to aquifers. Farmers next to drilling locations have been recently reporting the deaths of livestock, placing the blame on groundwater contamination. Despite these concerns, there are many proponents of fracking. Advocates highlight the process as important to the energy security of the United States. Several landowners are also content with receiving loyalties that drilling companies pay out for using their land. Hydraulic fracturing has truly inspired a heated debate among U.S. citizens. A Quinnipiac poll has reported that 45% of New York residents oppose fracking, while 44% are in favor of it. Although public opinion on fracking is still up in the air, it's safe to say that the process won't be going anywhere anytime soon, and hopefully, through more independent research and better public communication, people will be able to understand and accept the process of hydraulic fracturing.